Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, inshallah, in this video, we will uh, discuss the new features available in uh, SEG uh, version 4.05. Uh, the dimension style. In version 4.04, .04, the uh, current application uh, setting form will include only two formats for the dimension style. You can make it in millimeters or inches. From the unit type, you can select the uh, decimal format and the uh, fraction format in case of using the uh, inch uh, format for the dimensions. Here uh, in version 4.04, .04, you can figure that the style of the dimension can be in the millimeter format like that case in the uh, bill of material or you can make it in uh, inch format and you can use the fraction so you can make the format of the uh, dimensions in uh, the fraction format uh, like mentioned in uh, this image uh, you can uh, change the fraction format from half up to one pair uh, 64. Uh, the dimension style in uh, version 4.05. Here you can figure that we uh, develop a new uh, option for the dimension format. This option will give you the ability to select between uh, different types of dimension style. So you can make it in millimeter or inch, or you can make a mix between millimeter and inch with different styles as uh, on the uh, mentioned image here in this sample uh, in uh, version 4.05 you can make this mix and you can make it appear on the bill of material and the other tables uh, which you can generate it by uh, SEG software as you can figure the lens uh, for example here The lens here, uh, the value of the lens will be in millimeter and here the value in inches, including the uh, fraction format. Uh, for the pipe size setting in version 4.04, uh, there was only two options for the uh, uh, pipe size format. Uh, the first option was the uh, nominal pipe size format or then format but in uh, uh, SEG version 4.05 the uh, number of uh, formats uh, now become uh, six different uh, formats you can select between them like NBS or then and you can make a mix between NBS and then like here on this image Here that's uh, a part of the uh, nozzle table format and you can figure that the uh, nominal pipe size you can make a mix between the NBS and the DIN like uh, in that column and the outside diameter here you can figure that the size uh, of the pipe in millimeter and here in inches with a fraction the same for the thickness. Uh, another uh, feature uh, will be available uh, on SEG uh, version 4.05, which is auto sorting for uh, extra items in SEG bill of material. In version 4.04, uh, you will need to fill the item number value for each item, you will import it as an external element, not included in SCG Bureau of Material. But now, in, uh, in the new version, you, uh, the, uh, this number will take the uh, auto sort number uh, after the uh, standard Bill of Material of SEG. So you will not need to define the item number for the extra items. One more uh, feature available now for uh, in SEG version 4.05, uh, 
which is exporting to the uh, XLS uh, Excel format without needing the Microsoft uh, Office. So uh, the uh, uh, this option will give you the ability to export all tables in SEG in XLSX format uh, without needing the uh, Microsoft Office. Here we have uh, this project, and from the setting, let's change the uh, format of the dimension to uh, millimeter and the, si the size of pipes to uh, nominal pipe size. NBS and now let's check some tables for bill of material table for example you can figure that the uh, the all dimensions will be in millimeter like the inside diameter the thickness the minimum thickness after forming straight flange for all that you can figure that all dimensions will be in millimeter format the same for the uh, pipe size it will be in uh, NBS format like that and if we open the nozzle table, you can figure that the uh, nominal pipe size will be uh, in, uh, in NBS, like that. The same for uh, any value in millimeter, like external projection or the uh, thickness of the pipe, the outside diameter of the pipe. Here now, let's uh, check uh, change the setting. Let's make the uh, dimension format in millimeter and make the uh, num size of the pipe in DIN format. And let's check the bill of material again. Here, let's open the bill of material. You can figure that the uh, inside diameter of uh, the uh, this head format change it to be uh, in inches, including the fraction. And here, the, uh, the pipe size become in DIN in case of uh, flanges like that and if we open the mm, uh, nozzle uh, table you can figure that the size will be defined in then so here the size of nozzles like that okay now let's change the format in uh, millimeter and inches and here let's make it nbs and then and let's open the bill of material table here you can figure that the nominal pipe size changed in NBS and then. And here for uh, the other di uh, lenses dimension, here the value in millimeter and between brackets in inches uh, with fraction. Let's open the nozzle table. Here you can figure that the size of the nozzle and the dimension of nozzle. Now let's export the uh, bill of material table in uh, Excel format. So let's go to the desktop and save this file in Excel format. Let's close this one and bill of material. You can figure that the bill of material now exported and included the column of the BART name. So you can uh, figure out the BART name in, uh, in the SEG tree. For example, here this flange. You have two items. Uh, the quantity uh, for, of this flange is two items. One of them related to uh, nozzle N3, and the second one related to nozzle N7. Okay, uh, thank you for your time. And uh, if you have any questions, kindly contact us uh, on technical support email or contact uh, at segcatsolutions.com. Thank you so much.